My name is Werner Herzog. I'm a filmmaker from Germany. I made some 70 feature films and documentaries. This shouldn't intimidate you. I never attended film school. In fact, I grew up in a remote mountain valley and I never even knew that cinema existed until I was 11. I made my first phone call when I was 17, but my first film when I was 19. I just wanted to share with you some of my experience to give your videos more class, style and precision. First thing watching videos, I always notice very unsteady shots. But this camera has an ultra steady pro video stabilizer. Go beyond the inbuilt stabilizer. Don't move it just with your wrist. Just tuck your arms against your body and start moving with your entire body. You get very steady, beautiful shots. You move in and close to the lady. And then I want to see the three of you. But watch my shoes. I put on sneakers that make no creaking noise. Pay attention to sound. We have three inbuilt microphones here that hear everything from everywhere. Wait for the plane to pass by, turn off the air condition. So you can give real class also by attention to sound. For long lasting shots, lean your body against the tree, a wall or anything, but for real long stuff, 20 minutes you want to hear how grandpa fell in love with grandma. Just hold your camera like this here. You can hold it for 20 minutes. Try out your time lapse, but in this case, you need a small tripod. I shot this very strange, beautiful shot by clicking a single frame exposure every eight seconds, but now your camera does it all on its own. Try out your slow motion. Sometimes I've used it for stylization. Here you have the roughest of oil workers, roughneck guys, but in slow motion they become very sweet, wonderful people. Be inventive about the position of your camera. It all has to do with your spirit of finding. I'm putting it down on the ground, ultra wide. Let's assume a sheriff walks into an empty western town. It's dangerous and he walks in. How do people enter your frame? Literally from everywhere. Your camera has an omnidirectional autofocus, meaning from wherever somebody enters the frame, he or she will be in focus. So I'll show you something while somebody spiraling into frame, which I have used in feature films. My editor, Marco, has to do the filming now. So the actor has to stand right next to the camera, swing the leg right in front, but contort it against the walking direction and spin the body and the face into camera like that here. And it gives a feeling of disorientation of your actor and it's beautiful. Develop your style. You have the possibility of using a 120 hertz screen, giving your shot an enormous smoothness, precision, almost ultra realism. Let's go to a wedding. Bride and groom are dancing. They rotate in one direction, but you move your camera rotating in the opposite direction. It gives an almost dreamlike smoothness. Just be inventive. Oh, the light went off. Let's use a candle. With almost no light, this camera still can film. It's astonishing how beautiful the shot can be just with a single candle. Very beautiful what it does to us. This camera has such a range that you can also shoot on a glacier in sunlight. It has all these possibilities. It's enormous. Just try it out, test it, test the lights. In such a short time, I cannot teach you much about light. Our cinematographer, Steve Poster, has spent almost all his professional life just doing that. Now to the choice of your lenses. You have an ultra wide, you have a 10 times zoom and a macro. So a young man hands over a present, a ring to his girl. So it looks like this in wide, but we are curious, so I'm switching to zoom. Or I could use a zoom 
as a fixed long lens, I want to see the face of the young lady. But if you are really curious to see the ring up close, you have to use your macro and you have to use your spirit of finding. Stabilize the hand, stabilize your camera, stabilize it, and you can get that close. It looks beautiful. This gives class to your picture. With this camera, you can explore the world of the small. I once filmed the caterpillar. Look how strange it looks. I really love this. Try things. You have a wonderful tool. Stay curious. But beyond what I told you, just make your own rules. I want to see you create videos that have the best you have got in you. Best of luck with your Oppo Find X2.